Are you feeling lost in the maze of business decisions? Or maybe you're tired of taking the wrong turns all the time and all these dead ends. Well, let's discover the shortcut to success with On Top of the World Wisdom. Hey there, my name is Isai Rodriguez and I'm your friend. And this here is where we build your leadership skills and your home business profits one actionable tip at a time. So hit the subscribe button, ring the notification bell, and let's get started. So I'm super excited to be your guide today as we uh, explore a topic that's crucial for success in our industry, right? We're, we're going to be taking about uh, talking about making moves in your business and what that looks like and what that is really. You know, um, in this crazy, crazy journey of entrepreneurship, a lot of times we find ourselves facing tough decisions. Am I right? Like, should we launch that new product? Should we expand our team or, or maybe pivot our marketing strategy, right? There's always, you know, it can feel like you're standing at a crossroads at any given moment, right? Not exactly sure of which path to take, but listen, don't, don't worry about that. Don't sweat it because... Today, we're going to uncover the secrets to making those big moves with confidence and clarity. All right. So and we're talking we're, we're going to be taking a lesson right out of the amazing book. I call the lesson anyway, uh, on top of the world. Um, so, yeah, that's the that's the name. Now, in this book, it teaches us something really important that the best time to make decision is when we're on top of the world not when we're down in the dumps not when we're down in the valleys when we're quote unquote on top of the hill right now think about it like this when you're on a mountain right everything looks clear right am i right like when you're at the top of a mountain but you're looking out you have this broad view of everything that's going on right well you can like again you can see you can see the big picture you can spot any obstacles that are in the way or that lay out in front of you you can uh you can set sail to a specific destination right you can chart your course with precision because you see all of these obstacles and you see all these things that you'll need to overcome when you're on top of that hill right that's exactly how we we should approach our business decisions, right? So what does that mean for us in the world of direct selling and network marketing? What does that look like, right? Well, here's what I found. It, it, what it means is that when, when things are going well, uh, when things are going good, when, when you're rolling, you're rocking and rolling, that's the time to strike. That's when you want to make your moves, right? When your team is thriving, your, your sales are soaring, you're, you're feeling unstoppable, right? That's when you make your moves. Now, what about when things aren't going so great, right? Because again, there's ups and downs always, and you have to kind of know when that happens, right? You, when, so when you're in the valley, when you're facing challenges, when you're in the midst of setbacks, right? Um, that's when we have to persevere, right? That's when you, you dig in. That's when you uh, turn on your grip mode, <laughs> right? Just like the, uh, the runner that's pushing through the pain to reach his, you know, their second win. And you, just, you just keep going. You, you have to push. You have to muscle through it. And you have to keep going. Because here's the thing. Every challenge we face, every obstacle we overcome is essentially building our character, right? One obstacle, one challenge at a time. So it's, it's preparing us for the, for the next big climb, right? So even when we're in the valley, you know, we keep our eyes on the mountaintop. Stay focused, right? You keep your eyes on the goal and stay focused on it. And when you finally reach that peak again, that's when you strike. That's when you start, you know, uh, making your moves again. That, because that's when you'll be armed with clarity. That's when you'll have the most confidence to make the, the right moves, right? This is like what uh, a lot of the gurus, they, they like to call momentum or the big mo, right? I'm sure you've heard that. So let's keep this lesson in mind as we go through the ups and the downs because we're going to go, we're going to have ups, we're going to have downs. That's just part of business, 
right? So as we're going through business, you know, as we're going through this journey and you have your ups and your downs, just keep that in mind that don't make major decisions when you're at your low. When you're at your lows, what you should be doing is reaching out to your mentor, reaching out to someone with more experience, reaching out for uh, guidance, right? Someone who can uh, help you, uh, give you a lending, like lend their hand, like, hey, grab my hand, let me show you the way. You know what I'm saying? Like that's what, when you're down at, in, in those lows, that's when you need to uh, reach out for help, right? Let's wait for those mountaintop moments to make our moves and let's persevere through the valleys knowing that they're like, like you have to be knowing that they're, uh, th that's just part of the climb to success, right? So there you have it, my friends. That's my tip for today. The path to success isn't always easy, but with the right strategies, uh, you can conquer any mountain in your business journey, right? Remember, every step you take, every decision you make brings you closer. It's always one step closer to your goals, right? So keep climbing those mountains, facing those challenges head on and, uh, you know, making those moves, right? Because guess what? You've got this, <laughs> right? And together, we'll reach the summit of success with no, you know, in no time, without sweating. Keep hustling and keep believing in yourself because, listen, I don't know if anybody told you this, but you are unstoppable, all right? So anyway, if you found this episode helpful, if you found it inspiring, hit the subscribe button, ring the notification bell. And if you have any topics, uh, any topics, any questions that you'd like to uh, discuss, anything like that, feel free to drop them down in the comments below. Also, don't forget to follow the link in the description for access to my free masterclass training where I'll be showing you how I personally uh, put all these tips into action so that you can see it firsthand, so you can understand better. And, and I want you to do the same thing. I want you to be able to see what I'm doing so that you can do the same. I want to I want you to make your dreams a reality, right? I want to help you create your own personal financial fortune so that you can fight against inflation and ultimately create uh, freedom of time, all right? So until the next time, I want you to stay legendary and I'll catch you on the next episode. Take care now. Bye.